Real quick, y'all. Yo, it's 2:30 in the morning. I had went to the I had went to the bank. You know what I mean? I had to um make a deposit so I could pay my phone bill. And then I I stopped at the Wawa. Comment below if you got a Wawa in your neck of the woods that you can go to 2:30 in the morning. So since it's nice out and I ain't been out in like two days because of the because of the you know the, the gang stalking and all the bullshit that goes on in my life. Um Let me see if I go this way. The cops is back there. That make it make it make I three three cops just pulled up on me while I was back there. They was like, oh man, it's, it's, it's strange that you back here. Um sitting. I'm like, I'm like, first of all, who who told you I was back here? How did y'all know I was back here? Oh, we we was just doing all rounds and we just happened to see you, man. It was just bullshit. Like you could tell that they knew they knew I was back there. Um, two black cops, one white lady. This is two in the morning, two, three in the morning, then at three o'clock in the morning. It feels good outside. The weather's not bad. You know what I'm saying? See, all they all they doing is just um just trying to um create stress and cortisol, you know, in my body all the time, just to try to make you nervous and you know what I'm saying, you know, your heart start beating when you know that's just a natural effect, you know what I'm saying? You already know when you black. You know what I'm saying? In America, when the, when the police come, your heart going to start to race. You you can't, even though if you calm and you collective and everything, but that's just an adrenaline rush. It's like, that's just natural. You know what I'm saying? Like you on a roller coaster or something. You know what I mean? Um, you know, um, everything was all good because, you know, I'm I'm not, I ain't, you know, I ain't smoking nothing. I ain't, I ain't drinking nothing. So, you know, they ain't had no probable cause. I gave them my ID and everything, you know what I'm saying? They checking, they running. But it's like, I told the officer, I said, um, I said, come on, man. I said, there's people out here that really need y'all help. You know what I'm saying? I said, I said, there's people out here, you know, somebody kidnapped, somebody, somebody, you know, somebody, um, tied up somewhere, somebody getting raped or, or shot or whatever. And he's like, oh, no, don't, don't worry. We get to them too. I'm like, man, you, you wasting time messing with me. How the hell you getting with them? And you over here, you know, I'm basically harassing. They ain't gonna, they ain't gonna use that word though. They're not gonna say harassing. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's not, it's, cause they, they gonna, they gonna lie. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's not harassment, but you know, if you're a TI, you know that it's just pure harassment. That's all it is. That's all it is. I ain't even. I've been in the house for like two days. You know what I'm saying? They ain't even go outside. And this is, as soon as I go outside, this is what a nigga gotta go through. Even, even when I try to hide. I tried to dip off and hide like it was in the area where um I got enough time. It was in the area where um you know you know like I, I didn't go in the park. I was on the outskirts of the park because you know, I know they these are these are after hours, so you can't you know go in the park. You know what I'm saying? Because then they give you they can really really get you get you a ticket or whatever. You know you know what I mean? So um but. You know, it's just crazy. It's just crazy, man. They they just they don't they want to make sure that you don't have no type of peace in this police state, in this in this in this um this martial law that we're in. You know, what I'm saying this is all martial law. You know, what I'm saying he was writing down something. He wrote down my name or whatever. I don't give a damn. You can write down whatever you gonna write down. You already know me anyway. You know, what I'm saying I don't need nobody be faking the phone. Like like as if you know what's your name and and and, and this and this and that. Like you already know everything. My license plate, you, you know, you ran my license plate. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, the car is in my name. So, it's like, it's just all bullshit. They just want to harass you and just act like, you know, like they, they doing their job, but they're not. They're just gang stalking. That's the only thing they're doing. They're not doing their job. They're not out here trying to really, really bring peace and tranquility to the planet. They out here destroying the planet and being and being absurd and destructive. You know what I'm saying? That's all they are. It's Cointel Pro. Stasi cops. They're not real police officers. These 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 cops out here are not they're not for you. I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm telling y'all people. If you believe that shit, then you just a dumbass. You know what I'm saying? I think that's another cop might be right in right ahead of me. <laughs> right here parked pulled on the side. You know what I mean? How much time I got left? I'm about to run out of time. I'm just letting y'all know, man, the world is a psyops. 
Nigga can't even go outside and get some fresh air without even being fucking harassed. I, it, it wasn't even a pullover. I was already parked. They came and just pulled me. They came and straight, straight to me. Like, you could tell that they knew that I was there. You know what I mean? I was like, who called y'all? Oh, no, no, nobody didn't call. We were just doing rounds. You. We are watching you. We know who you are. And we are going to keep watching you. And you are going to be okay with it.